Previously on Mr. Student Body President. The student body thinks we're perfect. We're the light of their sad little lives. Mr. Deborah and their elitist friends will never understand what the average Behringer student cares about, like I do. Well said, Tyler. Yes! Yes! And if you do a yearbook feature, just call it Tyler Fest, you know, for clarity. Advanced copy of the yearbook. The legacy of my life's work this far, all in one leather-bound volume. Well, nobody's gonna see it because the yearbook sales this year are shit. So if you wanna keep that advanced copy, you're gonna have to plug it on the morning announcements with that exact same idiotic enthusiasm. Those are the terms of the deal that I made with Tamika. Oh, yes, Tamika! She used such a good photo of me announcing staff skip ball. She said she was gonna crop me out. All right, all right, you can do that on your own downtime. Should ever ahead in all of the opinion polls, probably because everyone's still raving about them, like saving everyone from heat exhaustion or whatever. Oh, yeah, right. Tyler, I said the yearbook can wait. Hadley, in 50 years, when we look back on our best selves... The yearbook will be the only thing to remind us of who and what we once were. I know, Tyler. Oh, wow. Savannah got best laugh? Huh. I was so sure Brittany Martin was gonna get it. And Ainsley didn't get most likely to be a news anchor? McKenna did? That's weird. Wait, let me see that. It's so obvious. Hey, Tamika. Tyler, the yearbook is finished. The window for constructive criticism is closed. Actually, that's not why we're here. Although, I did think the layout of the dedication could have been a bit more contemporary. Okay, listen. Forget the announcements thing. Guys, don't waste my time. I already have enough problems with Miss Crick up my ass. Just because everyone's like, why pay $87 a piece to remember a year that's been preserved on the internet for eternity? Fucking Generation Z. Okay, hear us out. The Superlatives, mm -hmm. a yearbook-sponsored award show. The first school assembly with a red carpet, senior superlative acceptance speeches, and an after-party planned by the winner of most likely to be a party planner. The Superlatives, huh? <laughs> what can I say? I guess I'm desperate. There's gotta be something in it for you guys. Mm. Well, let me guess. Tyler wants to host. Mm. I think we have a better idea. I hope this works. What's up, Behringer High? What do you say we kick off a new Behringer High tradition with an old one that we all know and love? When I say D's, you say nuts. D's. Yes. D's. Yes. When I say dev, you say butts. Dev. Butts. Dev. Butts. Can't believe this became a tradition. D's nuts. Dev butts. Woo! Woo! All right, babe. Let's get things started with the announcement of our very first senior superlative. It's superlative. Here we go. You guys are gonna love this. Kids got the superlatives. Yeah. What the hell? This was brilliant. I know. Come on, no guys. Shut up. We have one more award to announce, and it's a big one. A male class clown goes to Shane Yaker. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? Shane Yaker is class clown? This is bullshit. That should have been me. These popular ass motherfuckers wouldn't know funny if it shat their pants in front of them. Come on, bro. I'm funny. I'm the real class clown. You know what? Grody Awards, tomorrow, courtyard. Be there, son. Grody out. Grody. Woo! This was part of the plan, right? What is happening? Here's a big one. Class clown goes to Derek Grody, me. <laughs> that makes sense. Next up, dankest weed hookup. And uh, sweetest friend, Justin Kramer. Get up here, bro. <laughs> Dude, always. Yeah, you got it. Next up, uh, smelliest shits. You know him. You love him. Give it up. For Mike Day Silva! Get up here, Mike. Come on, let me shine. Everyone's watching, they all know that. Next up, most likely to succeed. 
Damn butt! Damn butt! <laughs> <laughs> All right, losers, get out of here. It's over. What? Dude, first you give class clown to yourself, which is already weird, and then you give smelly shits, which I clearly should have won, to some guy named Mike? Mike's awesome. Dude, this is bullshit. Yeah, where's most likely to become a news anchor? Yeah. yeah. I went to this school, too. I mattered. McGunty Awards! Dumpsters! Ten minutes! Be there! We'll just get out of there. Yeah. First up, best parents. Sweater girl. Most likely to be a time traveler. Future. That girl. Me? Yes, definitely, yeah. Most likely to be a time traveler. Pass. That dude. Ezekiel, nice. Best part. Many Jim! Woo! In your face! Literally. Dangliest earring. Handsomest backpack. Most likely to shit in the teacher's lounge. Most likely to actually be a unicorn. Cutest hiccup. Spaghettiest hair. Uh, I guess that's it. But I still didn't get one! Yeah, me neither! Oh, I'm so sick of this! Uh, I guess you guys can give yourselves your own awards? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm gonna make my own damn yearbook! Yeah, yeah how about sophomore superlatives? Huh! See? See? Put a copy, I'm coming for you, bitch! Yeah! No longer will we pay $87 a piece for some book that only favors the few at the top! Our new yearbooks will free us from the tyranny of the elite. Now we can all remember high school the way it matters. Our way. You are all superlative. Yeah. Oh. They get it. Fuck the yearbook. Indeed. Nice. Oh. Yes. Yes. Thirty-one orders? You think I can sell ad space on thirty-one orders? This is a record low. What the hell happened, Wolf? Adler. What's going on? I don't know. Hey, Tyler. If you're so salt of the earth, how come the leaked photos of this index show you have more pages in the official yearbook than Chad and Deborah combined? I'm the current student body president. I'm involved with a lot of school activities. How'd you see that, by the way? So you admit you are an elite after all. If anything, you're worse than Chad and Deborah because you pretend to be like us. You guys are fucking phonies. Now, 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 I know all you sophomores are currently reading Catcher in the Rye, and we've all been there, you know, thinking we're so special and no one gets us. He's talking down to us. He's shitting on Catcher in the Rye. None of these candidates represent us. Hadler and Shadebra are the same. They will do anything to get elected. Tyler claims they're not above us, but look at the evidence, people. Look, I say we need a candidate that truly inspires us. Like Blair did. Blair. Yeah, that's me. The Holden Caulfield the Behringer. Sticking it to the phonies. Blair, have you ever considered running for student body president? I'd prefer walking around, but sure. I'm down for whatever. You've got to be kidding me.